What's going on? It's Casey from casey-sounds.com. So today's video is an unboxing video and a review of a ring light that I got sent. I got hit up by a company who sent who wanted me to review. He wanted me to review their ring light. So yeah, it's come. It's arrived. So I'm just gonna quickly do the unboxing. Let you see that, and then I'm gonna do a review on it. Let's get. This is the box it's coming. You see me? Can you hold this? You said you were making the video. We were making the video. Do you want to hold it for us? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Down. Can you see me in the box? Yeah. So if you can't see me properly right now in the camera, because the little boy's cameraman today. He's new, first time. Am I in it probably? No, I can only see up to your chest. Yeah, I can see you now. Uh, what are you getting in? Just the box? Yeah, I can see the box and you. Is he doing it properly? Do you want it? Do you want all of you in and the ring box? Kind of, yeah. Yeah, it is in. So, what have we got in here? Let's have a quick look. Nice little hold all bag here. So a nice little bag comes in, just in case you need to travel with it, which for me is a good look so far. So far, so close, have a look inside. And then we have the ring light. The ring light, kind of big, 19 inches. It feels quite plasticky, but it feels kind of sturdy at the same time. Got all different on off switches and some buttons that I'll go into a bit more detail afterwards. But yeah, this is it. See what we've got in there. Then we've got this mains plug. No stand. I'm sure it's supposed to come with a stand. Oh, the stand in there. And yeah, look. nice plastic box stand as well. So I've done the unboxing for the VC light, if I didn't mention that earlier, the company's name is a VC. Yeah, I'm just going to quickly set it up and then show you the different settings on the back of the controls and the difference in lighting. At the moment, all, the only light I've got in is the room light and natural light. So I'm just going to quickly set it up now so you can see how it goes. So yeah, that's the bag I showed you earlier. There's no branding on the bag, I thought they might put some branding on there. You know, like when if you're carrying it walking about and that would have been good advertising for them, but oh well, maybe that's something they might look into. So this is the stand that it comes with here. So it's upside down, that's where the light goes into. So you just got to kind of hold it with one hand. And then pull it through. And then you've got like a little tightening knob on here. So you want to just tighten that up. And the light sits on that piece here. So 
So you just unscrew that using the knob. Sit that on top there. Got another little, got another little knob here. Just to, if you're on a different angle for the light, show you from the side. So I'm gonna keep that straight for now. Tighten that up. So on the back of the light you've got a little slide where you put your hot shoe key in and then you sit your camera on top of that so I'll just quickly put the hot shoe in. So you get two hot shoe keys and you get a nice little one for your, your phone which is cool. So you just slide that in using the key, the square part of the hot shoe. Just straightforward, pretty just straightforward, pretty straightforward. Use this square part, slide that in, tighten it up with the little screw. So now I've done that, I'm just going to quickly turn it on so you can see the LCD display and quickly just show, go through some of the functions that's on the unit. So we've turned that on. And boom. So that brightness is on 72% at the moment. Goes all the way down to 1% up to a hundred percent which is almost blinding and if you press the middle button here change the temperature of the light so you get like that orange little orange glow and you can turn it almost to like a white blue light so what I'm going to do afterwards is just show the differences in the lights the percentage so that seems quite bright then just press the button again and just use the dial for how bright you want it and it will tell you at the back the different settings that you've got it on so you you'd always know what you're doing so you use the channel button to sync up with your wireless remote and then you use the GP button to choose what group you want to put it on so you've got A, B, C, D and E and the button to the right of that gives you a selection of brightnesses give you different selections so from 1% up to 100% so if you just keep clicking that it will go from 1, 25, 50, 75 and 100 so now I'm just going to show you what it's like while I'm recording so I quickly just mounted the camera on onto the shoe mount what I like about the shoe mount as well is it's on like a ball sort of thing so you can line it up so that it's level straight and all that so yeah I, I really like that straight away I can notice the difference in, in the light and that's just some 1% so I'm just going to quickly go through 1, 25, 50, 75 and 100 percent and also show you the different temperatures of the light as well so that's 25 percent and that's 50 percent 75 percent and that's 100 percent I think 100 percent seems too bright 100 percent is definitely way too bright for me um, it's cool though I do like it I like the light it's, uh, it's cool because it, the, because it's a 19 inch you don't feel like you're getting you're being blinded by looking into a light because obviously it's around the camera so um yeah that's cool that's pretty cool so i'm just going to quickly show you what the different temperatures are like turn this down 
So that, this is 100% at 3000K, so this is the, the lowest setting on on the unit. And to be fair, it's quite a, a nice, it's a, it's a nice, um, a nice hue, a nice shade, a bit ambiance. I'm, I think I like this one. Or do I look too orange? Bringing out that terracotta in my skin. Yeah, that's a nice light. So I'm going to quickly change it back to 5800K. So you can see the difference. I haven't, there's also a wireless. Just I forgot to mention, there's a wireless remote that comes with this, but I didn't get the remote for some reason. So I might get in touch with them, see if they can send that through as well, which would be good because it's a little bit hard to try and adjust it and get it right, and having to keep changing it and then stand, come back into the spot to see if if it works for you. You can drop a comment below and, and let me know which one looked best, which one was more easier in the eye. That would definitely help. Um, obviously, I'm gonna watch the video back and I'll, I'll see for myself as well but yeah it'll be interesting to see what you think um, so far so good it's a really cool light what I like about it as well is the stand it's, it's quite a wide stand but you can make it more narrow so it doesn't really take up much space in the room my room's quite small so that is a plus for me so I'm going to turn it back up to 5800 and see what that's like now that's bright mate Definitely not going to be using that one, although it does look pretty cool. Which I not everything on my face. <laughs> um, yeah, I like that one. It is a little bit, bit much. Just uh, yeah, <laughs> it's too much, too much percentage. So I'm just going to quickly turn it down before I finish off the the rest of this video. So currently I've got it at 53% at 5,400, and yeah, I think that one's okay. So what I was doing just just that is just trying to change it while looking at the camera as well. So you can kind of do that if you if you haven't got the wireless remote, but definitely the wireless remote would be the way forward. So if you're looking for a decent ring light under 100 pound, then I definitely recommend this one. Also, you get a 10 pound voucher. So when you go to Amazon and you go to purchase, there's a little there's a little box. If you just tick the box, it takes 10 pound off. So kind of a no-brainer really. So if you're looking for a new ring light for whatever you're doing, then I highly recommend this light. It's decent. Hope this video has helped. If it has, hit that like button. Be sure to subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you get notified in time I put up a new video. Yeah, and drop a comment below. Tell me which one you thought was best. A, B, C. No. 1%, 25%, 50%, 75%, 100%. I know which one I prefer. Let's see what you prefer. Thank you for watching. I appreciate your time.